everybody, I'm Argolfumpf, I'm playing Immortal Love Bitter Awakening, we're gonna start the bonus chapter here, let's get going, ah, uh, yeah! Ayla, I'm so glad you're my wife, and now, in celebration of our honeymoon, I present you this gift, my family's amulet. Douglas, oh my love, what a lovely gift, what's happening? <gasps> Ayla, no! Ayla? So what is this, like a thousand years later? Um, okay, so a long time later, um, D Douglas gave the amulet, his family's amulet, to his beloved Ayla, and now Ayla is just gone. Ayla is, I don't even know what happened to her. I need something sharp to cut these ropes. I don't think he'll just let me take that coin. Well, I mean, he's a seagull, just scare him away. No, no, that seagull's way too intense for me, me to challenge. I'm sorry, okay. Wow, yeah, I have no idea who, wh what's going on. I need some context here. <laughs> what's going on with poor Ayla? Who is Ayla? And yes, we've got an object challenges. Okay, so we've got a mermaid. Um, we've got a pocket watch. Uh, yeah, okay. Looks like we're trying to fix the bagpipes. They're all fixed and it's wonderful. Okay, gloves are gonna go together. It's a form of a pair of gloves. There's a bell. Uh, okay, let's see if I can find a candlestick or a compass or a spyglass. Candlestick. There's the fan. A pocket watch, glasses, and a compass. Pocket watch, glasses. Okay, I don't know what type of compass they are expecting. Oh, that kind. Okay. So I found a coat. Well, that's beautiful. I can't open the cabin without a key. So there's a coin. I might be able to break this if I hit it with something hard. Ooh, and there's a key. Okay, I don't know why I'm finding coins, but darn it, I need to. It's for Ayla. Ayla. And I'm just gonna grab a coin which I just left on my bed for some reason because I'm a cool guy I don't know am I a pirate or something I don't even know like I'm an I'm on this boat and there appears to be nobody else on this boat besides just me and Ayla and I don't seem to have anything I need <laughs> okay we need an octopus or a squid and sword hilt maybe I don't know oh, there's a hint hint says nothing for me there Hint says, oh boy, there's another an object challenge. But the sword hint, sword hilt, goes over here. Fish to uh, get rid of that seagull, I imagine. Okay, seagull gives me the coin. I imagine those four coins will go here in this coin slot. Give me a death squid. A kraken! Okay, so that gives me a little hook. Fishing line, a fishing hook. Apparently I'm going to go fishing. Yeah, that would be a great way if I get a fishing pole here. Yeah, yeah, where's that fishing rod? There we go. We're going to use this in order to get that amulet down from the bottom of the sea, because I imagine that's where the amulet is. Turtle! Aw, what a cute little turtle. I need something to remove the cork. Well, obviously I'll use the corkscrew for that. Let's see, I need a... Tricorn. What on earth is a tricorn? I don't know. Okay, here's a key. I'm opening up. That key does not go to that lock right next to it. It goes to this lock. Obviously. And that is still not a tricorn. I don't know what tricorn is. It's like a unicorn with three horns. Um, a three-cornered hat? Oh, okay. My hat, it has three corners. Three corners has my hat. My hat, it has three corners. And that's the end of that. Okay, so putting all my things together. I guess I use the line first, and then the hook. And then I'm gonna go fishing. Um, to the right? Where do I go fishing? Up here, obviously. Um, yeah, for a harpoon. A harpoon? What do I need a harpoon for? For moving these boxes? 
I thought I was trying to collect the amulet here. You're kind of throwing me off here, game. Okay, sort uh, the green discs to the left, and the red discs to the right, and the gray discs in the middle by pressing buttons. Oh, yes, one of these things. Okay, yeah. So this is how we um, basically move things around and say, hey, all the red discs are on the right. Well, that's good. No, no, so I, I would probably... Let's see, all the red discs on the right, huh? So, so I probably would have to do something like this, where, hey, I, I take all these greens, I'm moving them left, and then I'm replacing them with all these reds. And then I'm moving those reds over there. And that's how you would get a, a lot of these things. But th this is complicated puzzles. So I'm just skipping that puzzle, and what is going on with this amulet? Oh no, I'm trapped inside. What? I'm Vivian. The creator of this world. I'm from the Owl Clan, same as you. I captured you through the amulet's magic. So now, you're a prisoner here. Um, Owl Clan? What? Your wife, Ayla, will stay with me. Don't worry. She'll forget you very soon. Because she's been cursed. But I suppose you can try to escape. That is... If the Guardians let you. So I'm just a random guy. Okay, so now we know what time this takes place. This is obviously before Vivian becomes a good person. Obviously long before anything happens, uh, you know, in the main game. Basically, I'm just a random member of Owl Clan who tried to uh, escape with the amulet. And it clearly did not work out well for me. <laughs> um, okay, let's find some guardians. Maybe they will help me. How can I get a shard from him? I do not know. That is that is a scary owl. Okay, just grabbing stuff here. There's another shard. Um, okay, I imagine I'll be using paddles to row this boat. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Oh no, oh no. Hidden object. Scream! That's yeah, a hidden object challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Okay, let's find all these items I'm trying to find. An anchor. That's a little heart. Yay! Oh, it's an unfinished apple. There's still a little piece left. I thought that was the heart, not the apple. In any case, this shovel needs a handle, and this is a moose. Moose horns. There's the heart. Okay, here's the handle for the shovel. Okay, I need to catch the butterfly with a net. Okay, that's good. There's the mask. Um, the dagger's stuck. I need to pull it out with something. Or I could just cut it out. Very gently just go tap, 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 and then it's done. So, what did I get? I got an anchor. Anchor's away. So, yeah, I need to find something to get that owl to be my friend. What does this anchor need? fishing net. Good, 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 good. So something get that owl, and then when I get all the crystal shards, I imagine I'll be using them there. Okay, so can I get into the castle? No, it looks like the castle's closed here in the bonus game. Um, okay, can I destroy this? Ooh, she's not gonna like that. <laughs> Which flowers do I need? I don't know. Uh, for now, I'm just gonna grab a shard and then back away. So, is there anywhere I can go here? Ah, ha ha! The upper part of the castle. We did not explore this area in the main game. Thought it was a little strange myself. Okay. Grabbing items here. And the sheep. Can't forget the sheep. Another shard. Sedative recipe. To prepare a sedative, you need two belladonnas and two poppies. Boil them for a couple of minutes. Okay, this... <laughs> That's a lot of instructions. I'm just grabbing, grabbing, grabbing the, the thing that says two of the red, two of the purple. Owls are difficult to catch, but I found a solution. I give them a sedative so I can capture them while studying magic. I figured out how to make a portal. When I was in prison, I learned all these magic tricks. One is to restore the magical artifacts. I need a wand and three different potions, and I can place it in the fireplace. Okay. This doesn't sound like just some random thing. This sounds like something I'll actually have to do. 
So I need to get those flowers first. And hey, what do you know? It's a fireplace. That's great. Because I kind of need it. Okay, going back here, what what did I need? I needed to get two of these flowers. Well, I'll cut them with the sickle. Um, did I get the wrong flowers? Yeah, I got the wrong flowers. Okay. Okay, got the correct flowers. Back over here. Where are the flowers over here? How can I light the burner? Well, with the light, I guess? Hmm, let's see. I'll use the bag to scoop up the embers. Magic ash. Oh, okay, that's not... I wasn't grabbing it because it was hot. I was grabbing it for some other reason. Here are the magic symbols. Here's magic ash so I can see stuff. That's nice. Okay, candle. Hi. Light the candle. Thank you. Use the lit candle here. Okay, the sedative's ready. I just need something to hold it in, like this bottle I've got. And I'll be sure to use it on the owl. Thank you. Okay, oh, hey, guess what, everybody? It's a hidden object challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Yeah. Okay, so I've got... A straw man. Okay, making a scarecrow sort of thing here. Okay, got it all done. That wasn't too tough. And uh, one of the hidden items is a crystal ball. That wasn't too tough either. So now let's just find all the items which are listed. A bear skin. I need a swan. I need a comb. I need an owl and a scarf. A comb, an owl, and a scarf. There's the swan. There's the scarf. There's the owl. I needed that magic wand. Okay, sedative on the owl. Thank you, owl. <laughs> Made the owl go to sleep. Oh, I just need one more shard. Just one more shard. Okay, I knew the magic wand. Oh. Just randomly over there, there was an owl. Okay. Oh, I guess the shards don't go there. Ooh, okay. I was 100% wrong. I thought that's what I was gathering shards for. Okay. Nothing to interact with here, except... Um, this spot. So crystal shards and magic wand, perhaps. Now to pour the potions in the right order. Green, obviously red, and then yellow. And then I wave my magic wand. Now I've got the thing which goes over here for the crystal bear. Love me, guardian! Thank you, Douglas. The strength of your love has awakened me. You came here of your own free will. That is why this curse cannot touch you. Yeah! I want to help you and your beloved escape from the amulet, but you must awaken the second guardian first. Aren't you good enough? But you must hurry. If you and your wife will stay here for three days, you will be trapped forever. Jeez, talk about time crunch. I guess, where's my wife? Are you going to give me an item to help find my wife? Oh, and now we can go inside here. Okay, well, oh, this works just as well. Now we can go to a new area and find more stuff. Where is my wife? I'm still wondering where she is. Okay, sickle here, cut this. Okay, um, I cannot bend these bars with my bare hands. No, that that is asking too much of me. I can't open this without the key. Again, asking way too much of me, buddy. Okay. Looks like we've got a number puzzle. I don't know what order to select those symbols, and selecting them randomly is probably going to take a while. Yeah, I guess it's going to take a while. I've got time. Well, I, I don't have time, actually. <laughs> Oh, guess what? It's a hidden object challenge! <laughs> oh boy, I haven't seen one of those in a while! Have I? Nope, nope, totally haven't seen one recently. <laughs> okay, okay, I found the key. Um, yeah, and, and more cards. Okay, it looks like I need uh, an unknown number of cards. I don't know how to tell how many cards I need. Uh, the frame is missing. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. But let's find more of these items. Oh, there's another card. Okay. Oh, come on. How am I not... 
finished with these cards yet. There's the frame. We've got the portrait. We're gonna need a hairbrush. Oh, another card? Yes, finally finished with this, this stack of cards. Okay, so I need a thimble, a crown, a flute, and an egg. Thimble? Yeah, it's hard to find thimbles. They're small and tiny. Um, where is the flute? Here. Woo! Okay, I found the key to the chest over here. Oh, that is nasty. I'm not touching that with my hands. Ew, ew, yuck. I don't want to get my fingers dirty. 